Hello again. Uh, it is Tuesday afternoon. Uh, I was up a little on the early side for me today. I had uh, my carpenter guy, friend of mine, show up and uh, was marking off in the backyard where we're going to put the the spa and the deck uh, so that when they come to spray paint where the buried uh, lines are, they'll see that. Um, and just so they know where they're working when they get to do that. And they're probably going to start that next week, uh, is the plan on that. And so I'm thinking it's probably going to look like it's going to be after Brick World before that's all done, but that's fine. Um, down here, I've kind of set aside the decorative modified bricks to be the next one, but really what's going on here now is this hard drive. Um, my computer's run into a problem. Uh, my laptop doesn't seem to recognize that it has networks attached to it. It just says no internet. And when I open up the network and uh, sharing center, or whatever it's called, I forget. Um, network and connection, maybe I forget. It uh, opens that window of the uh, uh, settings briefly and then closes it down immediately. So I can't get in to even look at anything. I'm not sure there'd be anything there anyway, because it's open long enough I can kind of stare at it and briefly and over a number of clicks, I'm like, I don't see where I would go to fix this. Uh, so it's, it kind of just is a problem because I use this computer to, you know, access brick store and all sorts of other things. I can still run the store off the other laptop, so I'm not closing the store. Um, but yeah, this is my main computer and my private computer, as it were. It's got all games and stuff on it, that kind of thing. So I'm trying to work on fixing it. And so what I'm going to do now is, uh, get this hard drive hooked up, which I've done. And I'm going to basically copy everything off the laptop onto the hard drive. There's plenty of room, not a problem. Um, and, uh, then I will take the laptop elsewhere to see if they can figure out what the problem is by copying everything off ahead of time though i'm, I'm limiting the problem if they tell me oh, they need to wipe it i don't have to worry about the data because i've already saved it uh so yeah that is kind of what's going on for me um i have more elements for the uh um the build for uh the air show the the jet we've got in, in this package these are the printed tiles that are going to go with it and so that's another project that this week is going to occur i'm going to get all those separated out and make sure everything's set up i also have boxes for them to put them in and i think we're going to work on a sticker as well so yeah i'll be looking really nice for that uh i have more of the that speed champion set now i'm up to 45 of them um I basically went to four stacks instead of three now because, well, it's just a little easier that way. Um, and I have five more on order, and I think that'll be the end of it. Uh, I think it, once they get to 50, we'll, we'll do them. So that is on the radar for relatively soon. Not super soon, but relatively soon. Um, and that is about all I've got. Um, I haven't uh, scheduled anybody else to come over and help additionally yet, but that's probably coming up soon in the next couple of days. Uh, Saturday, I have my gaming again, which is actually going to meet in person again, oddly enough. Uh, and then uh, we're also going to, there's a picnic on uh, Sunday for Memorial Day. Um, so yeah, there's lots of stuff going on for me. And uh, we're just going to cut it off there. I'm starting to ramble a little bit. But a couple of weeks from now is the air show, so we'll have some video from that. I'm probably not going to do a whole ton of video, but some. And, uh, yeah, we're just moving forward to different things. As always, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Um, I saw with a comment that was made earlier today that we're apparently at 907 subscribers, so that's awesome, too. Thank you very much. And, uh, yeah, we're going to try to get some ideas for Brick World and uh, when we get up to around 1,000 subscribers. So if you've got ideas for that, let me know. As always... Thank you very much. Hello. So we have finished sorting these decorative bricks. And as you can see, the Palisade brick and then these grill profile bricks are probably the most common with two drawers each. Uh, these uh, masonry bricks, pretty popular. i got a full drawer of those. And then the four long, one by fours of the uh, Palisade and the masonry. Got a bunch of those. And then just a few of these. These are the the other decorative piece that ended up in here um so yeah and i can think of a couple other decorative pieces that might end up in with this category 
if I had some, they're they're rarer. I think they're they look like um, a lion's head on the side of a brick. Uh, so yeah, it's a little different of a thing. And only three pieces that showed up that didn't belong in that category. So those can get added in at some point soon. Uh, actually, this one hasn't been sorted yet. The uh, the brick like that, the Technic brick, but those other two have been done, so we can just quality check them and see if they can be added directly into inventory if I have those two in those types and colors already. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're working on at the moment. So we're going to start working on color sorting these and just get them all ready so that when I get my computer back up and running fully, I can deal with them quickly or I'll just go and start perhaps using one of the smaller laptops. Uh, they're, I don't find the keyboard is comfortable to use. I feel like I'm making keying errors on it. So we will see what we can do. But I am currently working on copying files over from the computer to the hard drive. So that'll help a lot. In any case, as always, thank you. Hello. So it is technically late on Thursday. I have uh, neglected to take video for a couple of days, I think. Uh, I did have help on Wednesday. Uh, and yesterday I did not have help today that person had to cancel I got all of the modified brick taken care of uploaded and put away with the exception of the Technic ones which I have three shoe boxes full so there's a lot in there I did get an order that I took care of which was just this not very big at all but it's ready to go out uh, and uh, I took care of uh, getting the sets together for the lug event at the air show in a couple of weeks. That took a bit of time. Uh, and I got uh, picked up the last five copies of the Fast and Furious, or not the Fast and Furious, the, the James Bond 007 DB5 car that is going to be the next part out. The other ones are here. Uh, we can go take a look. Now this tote here is empty and this is actually I believe the first tote that I bought specifically to hold Lego that has now been emptied because other totes that I've emptied have been like clear totes that I got Lego in or things like that but this one was one I specifically bought for Lego um, so there's a lot of stuff over here there is some of the these bins over here have been dumped into a couple of times as well so those are getting fuller again and then um, when I say that tote is empty, by the way, part of the reason it's empty is because this bag is here. Uh, I got moved out and put over here. So this needs to get taken care of next. But, uh, yeah, we're getting there. Uh, trying to remember if there's anything else that I wanted to mention. Uh, there was an interesting part that got found here. Uh, it's a, uh, like a robot-looking thing. It's like got kind of these bionicle slash hero factory factory connections <clears throat> the part that I thought was particularly interesting was these little nubbies on it they come off it's a separate piece and this piece only occurs in maroon in only this set although there's seven of them in this set and then actually there's a, an extra one so it comes with eight and what this set is I'll just leave that there it's an old Ben 10 set from I believe it was a cartoon Ben 10 and they only made a few sets for this. Uh, it was quite a while ago, but this is one of them. And uh, it's missing arms and legs, but I really thought this piece was kind of interesting. So that's why I'm showing it. In any case, uh, we're going to break it at that. We're going to go get some rest. And uh, tomorrow's another day, and we'll get some more stuff done. As always, thank you very much. Hello. So it is Friday. Yeah, it's early evening and I've had help here today. They have gone and uh, a lot of stuff has happened here. So I finally dug in and sorted out the Technic type modified brick. As you can see, I've got all the different lengths down here. Now for some of these pieces, like the, the, the one by twos especially, there's at least three different types in here. There's the one with two holes. There's the one with one hole. And then there's the one that has the axle opening. So there's three different types in here. I think most of the rest are all just going to be pinholes. And I didn't find any that were 1 by 3 I don't think they make that length. But 1 by 4 6 8 10 12 14 and 16 And then the one by ones in the back. And then some of these square ones. And then over here, just a smattering of these other ones. Like these corner ones. And some other ones down through here. Um, 
these were the only pieces that I found that were not uh, in the right spot. While sorting, uh, my person found this, uh, and this is uh, Lola from the Avengers. Uh, this is, uh, I can't remember his name offhand, but it was his car. And it has an interesting feature here, like these things in the back, if you turn them up like this, it, trying to do this one-handed, but anyway, the, uh, the tires rotate down, and then you can see there's like these thruster things like there. So it would take off like that, and then you can put the wheels back in a normal fashion. And the nice thing about it is it, it rolls in that orientation. So that's really cool. Um, also, we found some of these gears, which are kind of interesting. All these different old gears. Like a lot of these are, they're uh, as old as me, if not older. Uh, the newest set that I found that had these some of these gears in it was 1969. And I still haven't tracked down this gear. Uh, so we're still working on trying to figure that one out. But I'm just kind of curious about those. Uh, we found a few other pieces that were pretty interesting. And so it will uh, be interesting to find out how much those are worth later on down the road. Uh, we'll look, take a look over at the sorting area. And you can kind of see what's been going on. The clear tote that was over here is now completely empty. Uh, and we started going into this tote here just because, well, it was here already. Uh, and so, yeah, there's all sorts of stuff that's coming out of that. Uh, you can see we have another one of the Army guys from Toy Story. That's been separated out because I know somebody is probably going to be interested in that. Uh, a couple of interesting printed tiles here. San Francisco and another larger panel. Just all sorts of figure parts and stuff in there. Uh, more brick separators. I actually took time today and I listed uh, eight more. I have now 101 used brick separators for sale that are in good enough condition that I consider selling them. Uh, but yeah, just all sorts of stuff. Uh, lots of non-Lego in here, although I did fish out a couple of things that I think actually are Lego. Uh, and then this is like a Technic bin that just needs to get dumped in the Technic section. Uh, so yeah, there's just all sorts of stuff going on here for that. Uh, none of these bins back here, because we have been dumping into them, are really full enough to consider washing yet. Um, but we'll get there and, you know, we're going to need to wash some other categories relatively soon. Uh, like snot doesn't have all that much in it, but, you know, eventually we'll get this flowing a little bit more. It may be a case where I end up having to wash a couple of categories at once just by separating them into what uh, laundry bag I'm putting them in. Uh, but yeah, so there's that. I also received, I went and picked up the last five of the speed champion sets i think i might have mentioned that already but they're now up here in the stack there are 50 of them there uh, so those are going to be ready to part it out i picked up another set that i had purchased that's actually i put it elsewhere than down here because there, there was more of them that were upstairs so we put them upstairs and i think that's pretty much it i can't think of anything else uh going on down here at the moment i'm going to get some food and uh, probably come back here and do some additional work that is all i've got thank you Hello again. Uh, it is Sunday night. I just got home from being out with some friends for uh, like a Memorial Day get together. Even though Memorial Day is tomorrow, uh, a lot of people are got other plans, so we got together today. Uh, not much has happened down here. I don't think I did get uh, an order that I had placed on Bricklink. I received that and got those parts put into the store. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I am still expecting Ben tomorrow, even though it is the holiday. And I'll uh, get some stuff done then. As you can see, I still have all these categories sorted on the cart. And then there's a few of the smaller drawers back behind the tape there. Um, there are some gears here that we found in the bulk lot last time somebody's here sorting. Uh, but yeah, there's not a lot really that has occurred here. So I'm going to go ahead and get some stuff done tonight. Um, part of that is going to be uploading this video. I think it's going to end up being on the short side, but that's okay. Um, and then we'll just start doing some more video for the next one afterwards. So, uh, yeah, as always, thank you very much. And uh, last time I checked, 910 subscribers, so that's really cool. Uh, and, yeah, we're just going to keep going forward.